To age with dignity is a human right that must be protected. The importance of safeguarding this right is perhaps most apparent in nursing homes, where an institutional medical-centered system has been the status quo for nearly two centuries. The history of this model has taught us that long-term care in America must be disrupted. The greenhouse model stands in sharp contrast to the current institutional paradigm. Designed to give elders the opportunity to control their own lives, greenhouse homes destigmatize aging and humanize care. As the leader in small house design and relationship-rich person-directed living, we create real homes where people are known and valued as individuals with intrinsic worth. Since 2003, the greenhouse movement has been a disruptive force in the field of senior living. The greenhouse model is all about reinventing care so that they are empowering lives. The lives of those who live there and the lives of those who work there. Greenhouse homes have reframed the way society thinks about elder care and aging. One of the wonderful things about working with the Greenhouse Project is the flexibility that the model allows. It is not one size fits all. The flexibility has allowed us to thrive and to make these greenhouses financially very, very viable. The Greenhouse model is not simply a small house movement, but instead it's a movement to deinstitutionalize, destigmatize, and humanize care for all elders so that all elders will live life, a meaningful life. In addition to garnering worldwide media attention, the greenhouse model has been studied by numerous academic researchers and government entities. This is a model that doesn't just feel good and feel right, but there is an evidence base to what has been done by several independent research studies. And the education has been building by assimilating our lessons learned with each greenhouse community that opens. For the past 15 years, the greenhouse model has been the leading agent of change in elder care, with nearly 300 homes built in 32 states. Our collective experience, wisdom, and evidence base has led to the launch of Greenhouse 2.0, an initiative that expands our scope of services to providers who want to transform their culture based on a proven model of success. The Greenhouse Project has evolved over the years in really significant ways. And it really has been a combination of the thought leadership that our adopters, our greenhouse partners bring to the equation and really recognizing that this is a dynamic, not static model. Greenhouse team members are empowered, along with elders, to ensure that everyone is treated with dignity and respect. The relationships that, that you see and that you witness, it's really, you know, you, you can't describe it until you see it. I've been able to have a good relationship with all the residents on our house. I got to know all of them and they got to know everything about me. My birthday, they all wear like happy birthday when I come in the morning because I get a good relationship with all of them. The success and ROI of the greenhouse model makes it a game changer in the field of aging services. Without the name Greenhouse Project, I never would have been able to sit in front of major donors and sell them on the idea. The model has exceeded our expectations in, in several areas. Uh, one is it is beating the financial pro formers that we originally projected. Um, the feedback from our residents, and from their family members is so, so positive. Uh, and occupancy remains, remains high at 99.7%. Occupancy rates in greenhouse homes are 10 to 15% higher than the national average. 97% of consumers favor greenhouse homes over traditional nursing homes. I have the ability to go out with my family, have a good time, and go out to dinner or to visit and come back with my extended family here. So it's not like you're going home to an empty house by yourself. So I asked Dad one night when he first moved in, I said, are, are you happy here? Do you like it? And he goes, I like it. And Dad doesn't talk too much, you know, from the Parkinson's, but he is very happy here. You want to give them that special place that they gave you as a child. They gave us a lot of love. My grandparents, um, it's that way in a small town. We were connected. This is a place that you can give that back to your parents. 